All right, I'm going to show you one of the super cool tools built into Magic School that if you are using any YouTube videos as instructional tools in your classroom is going to be a game changer for you. So if you haven't already been into Magic School, you are missing out. It has, uh, it used to be 50. I couldn't even tell you how many tools there are now. It is awesome. There are so many AI tools here that you will never go anywhere else. So we're going to explore the YouTube video questions today. So if you're using a YouTube video, there's a couple things you have to remember. Um, it can't be like an hour long YouTube video, which of course you wouldn't have your kiddos watching an hour long YouTube video. But it also has to have a transcript. Um, they should anyhow to be ADA compliant, but um, make sure that the videos you're using are um, included a transcript and then you can use this tool. So I'm going to go to the YouTube video questions. You can see I have mine starred. And if you didn't know that, you can take all your favorite tools. So maybe this lesson plan one is favorite. And when I click the star, it will jump up into the top. So every time you go to this website, those starred ones are already your favorites. So anyhow, this YouTube one's an awesome one. So I'm going to click on the tool. It's going to give me a couple of things like what grade level do you want this at? I'm going to say fourth grade. How many questions do you want? Three, five, seven. I'm going to say 10. I'm going to choose multiple choice. You could also do free response and true and false, but I'm just going to say multiple choice because that's going to give me the most bang for my buck watching this. And then it says to copy the URL. So I jump out to YouTube. I find something that will work. And if you're not listening to Eric Kurtz, by the way, you are missing out on all the awesome tech tidbits and googly goodness that is out there. He is phenomenal. Um, you can find his website at um, control alt achieve uh, it's awesome you definitely need to to follow him so anyhow i'm going to take one of his videos here i copied the link up here at the top i'm going to go back to magic school and i'm going to paste that link now here's where you'll find out if you've met all the criteria number one the video is not too long number two it has a transcript so i'm going to paste that puppy in there and i get this little pop up here transcript loaded successfully if anything is wrong such as too long or no transcript, it'll tell you up there what the problem is. If it doesn't have those things or it's too long, it just won't work. So now all I have to do is go down to the bottom here and click generate. It's gonna take just a second and here they come. So it's going to generate, I asked for 10 multiple choice questions, all from the video that I just pasted in there, including the answer key, where the time stamp of where it was at in the video. So if I wanted to make sure that artificial intelligence is the answer, I would go to 12 minutes and 13 seconds. So this is absolutely awesome. So it talks about it from 1213 to 1248. Great way to make sure that what you're using is correct. You can also edit these in any way you want because what you would do is take this, either highlight and drag over everything or click somewhere and hit control A, it'll select a whole lot. So I just don't, I'm just gonna select this right here. I'm gonna drag that. And if I copy that, I paste it into a document. Now I've got quiz questions already made for me. Tell me that is not awesome. Now, you really wanna be fancy? About ready to just blow your mind. Go over here where it says export form. See that little happy G? When I click that, I link my account. I allow access. You can see it spinning here and thinking. All I have to do now is click open form. And all those questions just got put into a Google form. Talk about easy. And if you want to go through and choose any of these or edit them, you're fine there. Tell me that is not awesome. Go into settings, it's already a quiz. If I were to click on my questions, if I click on answer key, it has already selected all of the correct answers. So if I wanted to edit anything, I may have to change that a little bit, but everything else is ready to go. I clicked a couple buttons, I'm ready to send this form out. So that's just one of the many, many tools in this site. So if I just go back to magic school, here are all of the available tools for you to use. You could spend hours here. So I use this all the time. Make sure you're taking a look at it.